Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to set up a Tekkit server on a Windows computer. This doesn't work on Mac, however I will be uploading a Mac tutorial soon and there will be an annotation on this video um, to go to that video. So to install a Tekkit server on a Mac you want to go to your browser, go to Google or Bing or whatever your preferable search engine is and go to and search Tekkit and then it should be the first thing that comes up www.technopack.net forward slash Tekkit. You want to click that link, there will be a link to it in the description to save you time. It's just me that. Sorry if you can name me then. And you want to scroll down the page until where it says get tech it and you want to see where it says server owners, download tech it, version, number, and then server. Um, this works for all versions, so don't worry if your version number is different to mine. So you want to download that. I'm going to cancel it because I already have it downloaded. And now you can close your browser because that's all you need for that. So let's just go extract it with WinRAR or 7-zip. Um, you want to create a folder anyway. I'm just going to create it on my desktop called um, tech it server if I can spell for YouTube there you go and then you want to open that and you want to drag all these files into the folder you just created so wait for that and then close all the other windows there we go and you want to delete the launch.sh um, file delete that and then you can just click launch.bat and your server should be starting now that's basically it all set up so I'm just going to show you that this does actually work and it yeah basically that it does work if you get any errors at all when you click launch.bat comment down below or email me at me at kieranjohnson.com or message me and I'll get back to you as soon as possible and try to help you come up with a solution so we're just gonna wait for this to finish downloading and there will be many errors like me eh, I can't find any because it's registered registering all the micro blocks but if there's any errors just ignore them because it will be looking for files that aren't there and generating them afterwards so there we go and um, once it's done you'll see where it says done um, and then some time in seconds and an exclamation mark that's when you know it's done so you want to leave this open and you want to open technic And you want to launch Tekkit, but first you want to click this little settings icon and you want to make sure you've got the same build selected. So on the website it said I had 1.2.9e, so that's the version I have selected. If the version is different on the website to the one you're using, you want to use manually select the build and select it here. If you don't have the same build selected, it won't work. So you want to click play once you've selected the right version. By the way, this does work for all versions of Technic servers. It doesn't just work for Tekkit, it works for Hexit, Attack of the B Team, Tekkit Lite, any any that you can think of, it should work exactly the same. So let's just wait for this to load up. If you want your friends to be able to join the server, click the annotation that will be on the screen at the end of the video, and it should be here now. Um, it, it will teach you how to port forward your server. If you don't port forward, you can't have your friends connect. Um, another way of doing this is getting a server at a hosting company, such as Lethal Hosting, and then they, you don't need to do any of this port forward and stuff, and the server will be up 24-7, and yeah, so it's just a much easier way of doing it. Uh, but if you want to do it yourself, you want to click Add Server, and then search Local Host. Mm, there you go. And then click Done. And then let me just delete this one. Alright, so local host and you should be able to connect. Wait for this to load up. As you can see on the console there on the right it says Race K twelve join the game. Um just to prove that I'm actually in the game and it's a working server, you type in hi YouTube. There we go. And you'll see it comes up on the console. So if you want to have access to all the commands such as time, day and so on, um, you want to head over to the console and type OP your Minecraft username. So since my username is RacerK12, I want to type OP RacerK12. And then you'll see I'll be able to so, yeah, I'll be able to do commands now such as I have too many items installed, I'll just be able to do this. So set game mode to creative. I can now play in creative. Um and yeah, so that's about it. But if your Minecraft username is say beast op beast that's what you type just op and then your minecraft username so yeah that's about it um if you want to stop your server don't click the x just type stop 
wait for it to fully stop and then press any key to continue and then you're done. If you click the X, it won't save any changes that you've done in game and delete all the things that you've built. So yeah, that's about it. Finally, thanks for watching. Um, if you want any more tutorial, tutorials on how to install plugins or any other type of server, comment down below and I will be sure to read the comments and take suggestions and I'll do any uh, video requests that anyone needs. So yeah, thanks for watching. Remember to leave a like rating and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Um, and yeah. Thanks for watching and goodbye.